the atrium of Akinash. A world shut inside another. This is what humans do when they don't understand a thing. They build walls around it. They put locks on the doors, and they put soldiers in front of those doors. The bigger the secret, the bigger the lock. And the craziest are those who want to pick it. May my ancestors forgive me. I'm one of those to my misfortune. Ah, this noise, these voices, I can't stand it. Amber, that damn golden mud oozing from the heart of the world tree. A magma of sticky dreams, all the thoughts of those who wanted to taste the forbidden sap. Humans, elves, all their private little chatter is mixed up in this disgusting soup. A flood of ideas constantly flowing into my head for all these years. It took so long for me to find this place. With each step, I heard my voice a little less and all the others a little more. I'm so tired. It's time to finish it. While I can still recognize my own thoughts. The heart of the tree. It's why I'm here. That, at least, I am sure is my own desire. Take possession of this source of infinite power, but also misfortune. It's time to move to the first phase of the plan. Drop your weapon. And it starts now. All right, beast, wake up. Answer when Lord Barnum speaks to you. Who are you? Speak! My name is Styx. There's a surprise. The elves give names to their monsters. Where do you come from? I've never seen anything that looks like you. I am one of a kind. It's the elves who created it, Father. That's obvious. They pulled this runt out of their sticky larvae, and they sent it here to spy on us. Speak! Is it the elves who sent you? Why are you here? <laughs> Elves, if you only knew. They don't need spies to find out what's going on in this accursed tower. So, you're working for them. What did you come here for? I came for the heart of the tree, of course. I knew it. Those degenerates want to retake the tree and keep their precious amber for themselves. Father, we must bring them to heal while we still have time. Enough, Aaron. I secured this alliance with the Elves, and I intend to respect it. For the moment, we need the Elves. You know it very well. Rubbish. Oh, yes, you do need the Elves. How many of you poor little humans died the last time you tried to extract Amber by yourselves, huh? How many? Hundreds? Oh, yes, you do need the Elves. But they don't need you. How long do you think you can lock them up in their own world? The Amber is theirs. The tree is theirs. The heart of the tree is theirs. And I intend to get my hands on it and take it away from here. They're dying to get their tree back, eh? But they won't do a thing. We have an agreement. An agreement? We don't sign agreements with people who have amber in their veins. <laughs> You're out of your depth, Mr. Governor. Oh, ho, 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 you've got some nerve. <laughs> I'm sure you've never even seen the heart of the tree. Oh, but I have seen it. Since I've been holed up in the bowels of the atrium, I can see it night and day, even in my dreams. And every day I say to myself, Hey, Rakash, the heart of the tree is over there, almost within reach. And by your life, you're gonna find some way to steal it, because you're not leaving the tower without it. The heart of the tree, yeah. Oh, this headache. What? I, where was I? Shit, my brain is an anvil. Yeah, yeah, I 
should be able to climb up there. See the dagger that Duncan found. I wonder where it comes from. It's not from here. Yeah, well, don't get excited. We'll play for it with dice tonight. In the meantime, keep your hands off. Okay, okay. I'll wait till tonight. They must be talking about my dagger. It can't be far away. I should drink this flask. It would perk me up a little. Well, more climbing, I guess. Stay out of sight until I find my dagger. Always keep to the shadows and walk where it doesn't make too much noise. Avoid running and farting. so close. Well, it's a mirage. It's so big that it seems to be close. But I still got a long way to go. So, from what I heard, the only access to the heart is a bridge which that two-faced Governor Barron has had closed off with a tamper-proof lock, and he keeps the only key in his apartments. And as if that wasn't bad enough, the whole area it's crawling with elves. I'm gonna have to go down into the prisons and free my... friend. He knows how to deal with an elf. <laughs> so, if I'm gonna survive in this tower, I'm gonna need somewhere safe to get organized, as well as a map of the atrium. Well, I'll get nothing done standing around here. I'll get my dagger, and it's off to work. Gotta be sneaky here. If I stay under there, I won't be seen. So let's take a close look. All right. Where's my dagger? Uh, I was afraid that I lost you, my baby. Well, I must have been dreaming. Hmm. There are maps of the zone stuck up here. They might be useful for finding a way to the tree. Let's see. We got maps of the area. 
I'll need more than that to get what I want. Assassin's rule number one, always strike from behind, especially when the fucker is twice your size. And remember to land on the carpet to make less noise. I can't leave this stiff lying around. That would be messy. Why can I hide it?
Control! Shot. An intruder! Shit, more guards. If I stay hidden behind this barrel, it should be fine. Get me some amber. Yeah. Ah, that that would straighten me out. Down there, maybe? I'd really like to study these cocoons more closely. It would be fascinating. Ah, uh, quite so, my dear colleague. I'd be willing to get my complete edition of the Encyclopedia of Mycology for the right to a quick peek through the keyhole just to make sure the way is clear. Get some now. My head is going to explode. No choice. I'll need some help. Hello, Rakash. I need your run carcass. Ugh. Damn it, I hate to. Yeah. You want some 
you've done right. Steal a body and do it yourself. <laughs> so fast here. It makes you wonder if there isn't some sort of crap in the air. Corrosive stuff like... something strange someone that let's take a closer oh shit mm -hmm. oh shit this one's for me
This one's for me. <laughs> no. Shit! A sliding grill. I'm stuck. Ah, this is impossible. There's got to be a way. Hey, sticks! Over here! What's that? Somebody there? It's Ozcan. I'll open the passage for you. Hurry up inside. Huh? Ozcan? Oh, my head. Yeah, I know that name. Ozcan. Yes, you can trust him. Anyway, you don't have a choice. About time, Sticks. I've been waiting for ages. I was beginning to wonder if Barryman and his gang hadn't done you in. There was a slight hitch. Well, I think so. Ah, my head feels like a wagon's gone through it. Well, we'll take care of that later. What are you doing here? Well, I'm here to tell you that I found a hideout, like you asked me to. I asked you? Uh, yeah, of course I asked you. Damn this headache. It must be why I can't remember what I did even yesterday. Good. I'm off to the hideout then. You'll tell me the way? All you have to do is follow the marks I made here and there. You'll see. This is my personal system. As soon as you see the mark, then you know that one of my hiding places is near. You can go inside. There's one close by with, as it happens, a list of other hiding places. You'll see. I often put some useful stuff inside. Thanks. I'm off. Whoa, 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 wait. You'll have to pick up the sewer pry bar in another hiding place. Oh yeah, uh, one thing I didn't tell you. The hideout is in the uh, sewers. But you know how it is. The more it smells like shit, the quieter it is. You'll fit right in. And to think I was beginning to like you. Sorry to disappoint you, but with your looks, it's best not to take risks. And anyway, the Royal Suite was already taken. In short, go on ahead, pick up the pry bar, and open the entrance to the sewers. I'll see you at the hideout. Well, well. Looks like Ozcan carries a flask in his belt. Let's hope I haven't lost my touch. <laughs> I could easily find these marks with my amber vision. Beat it, old man. 
Oh, watch out, Sticks. After what I did for you, you better keep your tongue behind your teeth. What? What did you do for me? I gave you the plans that will take you to the relics of the atrium. That cost me this fucking amber scar on my face. Besides, one shouldn't go too far. The relics of the atrium? You kidding me, Sticks? Yes, the relics, the last objects of the great fallen lords. Yeah, of course it rings a bell. Yeah, well, good luck. I paid enough for this shit and all your schemes. I should keep my eyes peeled. These relics must be pretty valuable.
mark drawn with amber, invisible to anyone who's never touched the amber. All I have to do is follow the trail. Everything wears out so fast here. It makes you wonder if there isn't some sort of crap in the air. Corrosive stuff, like. Years without seeing my family. They must have forgotten me. Here's the pry bar. A bit big for a key to a sleeping chamber. At last, Ozcan spoke to me of his list of hiding places, which must be here somewhere. I'll take it and get out of here. I got no desire to hang around. Change of guard. in his time. Is someone there?
time for a change of guard. Hey, I think I saw something. for change of guard. something. Hey, come on out Understood. and let's finish with it. Shit. I've got to get back on patrol. I don't have time for games. Understood. Under yourself. Time for a change of guard. What is it this time?
Time for change of guard. <coughs> oh, oh shit! <coughs> it was over away. there for crying out loud. Watch Let's it, go. monster! Time for change of guard. Anything after all? Shit. I must have been dreaming. Damn! To arms! The Let's enemy is here! Forward. Don't move! Oh, yeah. come on. <laughs>
never know. Nobody. Someone there or not? What was that noise? Stop! You'll be sorry if I find you, you little green skin. Who goes there? Show yourself! You'll be sorry if I find you, you little green skin. Something over there. Be 
It's okay. It was nothing. How long have you been hiding in the atrium? I stopped counting long ago. Long before coming here. It gives me a headache. So you weren't born near the World Tree with the Elves? It's not there that they made you? No. I wasn't born in the Amber Lake. On the other hand, you could say that it was there that I died. Sort of. It goes back a long way. At the time... Don't waste our time, dog! I imagine in the cesspit where you come from, this cell could pass for an elegant lounge. So let me dispel that misunderstanding. You're not at the Embassy of Akanash, and I didn't invite you here for tea and sympathy. You're in prison. And you're going to tell me, without any nonsense, how you counted on getting your hands on the heart of the tree. Then? The executioner here will take you to the laboratory and store your body in separate jars. On that point, you were right. It is here that you will die. Did I say that? Well, it's very simple. The first part of my plan was to find my bearings in your tower. And the only one who knows every corner of your hovel is the one who built it. The, the architect. Your old friend, Kerberos. But what a great plan. What a pity Kerberos mysteriously disappeared once his work was finished, isn't it? Oh, really? He disappeared? Ah, now that's unlucky, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> 
but no matter, because our dear Quirberus did not disappear without signing his work. Apparently, he left the complete plans of the tower somewhere inside the Akanash Library, and everything is there for the one who knows how to look. So I said to myself, Hey, Rakash, you're gonna move your butt. Find that library and dig us out the secret plans of the atrium. Sticks, welcome home. I'm upstairs if you need anything. Not a bad hideout, Ozcan. It's dripping with just enough moisture to save me from getting parched lips. Hmm. This might sound strange, but can you remind me how we met? You're right. It does sound strange. You must have taken a nasty blow to the noggin. It's lucky we met. Especially for you. You wanted to know some stuff? And I wanted to recover some stuff. You're good at stealing, I'm good at dealing. It didn't take long to come to an understanding. That's how it works in the bowels. Yeah, uh, it's coming back to me. I think. Listen, I gotta get to the Akanash archives. Any idea of the best way to get there? The library, eh? I can show you the way through the sewers, yeah. But what can someone like you do in there? I know it's none of my business, right? I'm looking for a map of the atrium. I can't always rely on the guidance of a blind old man. The plans, eh? In that case, one of my men, Hector, a copyist, could be your guide in this labyrinth. And how do I find, uh, what's his name? The Marks. I'll tell Hector and he'll leave some for you. You just have to follow them. Understood. And while we're on the subject, you know a safe way out of this tower? When I'm done here, I don't plan on hanging around longer than I have to. You want to leave the atrium? You could hop on an airship, but you'd still have to know when one is leaving. It can be months before the order is given to send one. So, who gives the orders? I don't know. It's paperwork. It's irritating, you understand? I don't like to strain my eyes. But I happen to know that all the signed orders are stored in the transport office. You could uh, forge one to suit your plans. Hmm, I'll try it. Thanks for the info. Well, I'm off. Oh wait, if you wanted to thank me, you could maybe bring me back something from the library? Go on. I've heard that a renowned treatise on alchemy is hidden there. The kind of book that's so radical that it was placed under a glass cover. Good. If I find it, I'll bring it back for you. See you later. Oh, one last thing. You're the rough and ready type, aren't you? If I were to ask you to eliminate someone for me, would you do it? Quietly, without making waves? You're starting to ask a lot. If I do it, it better be worth it for me. Don't worry, I fully understand that my eternal gratitude will not suffice. Anyway, in the docks, should you cross the path of a labourer called Godbert, make sure he has a little accident. I didn't appreciate it. When Enough with the life story. We do some business, that's fine by me. As long as you pay. See you later. Well, let's go to the embassy for this airship business, and then I'll go to the archives to look for the maps. Mm -hmm.